Good morning. Out of beat now. At last. Thankfully. Nice and flat. There we go. Have a look at that. Chris coming up here. Coming up on the rear. Who's gonna him? Head straight out. Um see what's happening. So let's go. Yeah boy! Out a bit further north, um, a bit further out, and a bit more uh, south, so we can drift that way. And, uh, Chris has already had three, I've yet to caught in it. So we'll see what the deep water brings. Go from here. We'll go from here. Dinner. See when I'm at a standstill, right? My battery shows 100%. Yeah. But when I'm moving, it... pulling. <laughs> yeah, the the power drops down to 50. Get in there. Because it's pulling. Yeah. Looks a good one. <laughs> Didn't want it anywhere. I just want a fish. <laughs> That's what's on here now. The sidewinder. What weight is it? Not that heavy. I think about 22. You want to make it heavier? Just whack a little weight on, innit? Have you got any of little egg weights? Because I've got some. Have you? Aye. I'll, I'll see how it gets on. If not, I'll have one off you if you don't mind. Is, is your line drifting away from you? No, nah, it's just sticking straight down. I'll try you at the bottom. Um, I'm all the way down. Yeah. What's it like? Faster than going forward. Really? You can't use a rudder though when you're going reverse. Yeah, makes makes good sense, so doesn't it? Aye. Done it again. 
Oh, got that one though. Cod, see coming up there. Here we go. I haven't blanked. No, you're off the blank. I'm off the blank. Which way? Bring it up first. <laughs> it was just dangling. Actually, men are about with stuff like getting stuff ready. Plenty of bait fish down the bottom, Mike. Yeah. Loads down there. Are they? they actually run or own the harbour. They own it. Doug, the dad, is the harbour master. Andrew, the son, runs the charter boat. No. Oh. oh, that's a good fish. Yeah. yeah. Maybe the one that's come off yours. Now to take a dead wing and I think this, this might be a pollock. No, a pollock would fight. Really fight. I thought they normally drop down a bit. No. I knew the cod round yes, might like the clap out. That is the fish. That's the one I got, you know. <laughs> That's where I reckon it's come over here. Hey. How long line you got on? Um, 25, I think it is. Yeah, it's a cod. Oh, it's foul look, man. Cool little thing. All right, but let me help you. Let me help you. It ripped its belly open, like. There we go. Not even two pound. Oh well. Still a fish. Yeah. Just updating you on what's going on. Um, Dad's in hospital, he's got weak 
to live, just to let me know. This is the last time I spoke to him. Double air? Aye. Double cod? Shut the front door. Oh, well, like well coming. Yeah. Like well coming. Aye. Don't think you were allowed in there, the lakes. In England in general. Yeah. I'm not sure. Halfway. Right, and me, that one there. Right. Can't believe the bloody battery went dead. First time I've used this colour as well. Colour you? Uh, like a limey green colour. Yeah. So I'm going to take him one. Let's get Get him back down. Where do you use bread on yours as well? You what? Use bread. No, I use the Emmy Jimmy way. The what? Stab them in the heat. No, so do you use bread? Oh, bread. I thought you said you bread them on heat. I, like, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, can't, I can't do mono anymore. Once I've discovered bread, Christ. He's on. Doesn't feel massive, like. But it's a fish. Yeah, just a little cod. Oh, my dear, how's that happened there? There we go. Only a little tiny one. Not even a pound of it. There we go. Nice little one. Nice little one. See you next one. Another day, hopefully. You need a bit bigger. Get yourself away. He's gone. See if I can get me anything bigger. It wasn't further south, but it wasn't much happening. 
there. Um, apparently, 70, uh, sorry, 97 foot. Um, I think it was heading to the deep of water. Um, harder ground. Um, it's funny. And I say it went quiet back there. Funny. A couple of fish, but they're not that big at all. It's not even worth banging about. Um, at the moment, I've got one keeper. This has got one keeper. We've had a few smaller ones between us. Um, so, let's try over here and see what happens. Get this across. Barry's just gone dead. Yeah. That's not meant to fuck that one either. Whole fucking thing's going apart in here. Yeah, 
Um, yeah, that there and that's lifted a bit. Yeah. See the plastic around it. It's mad, isn't it? Ah, oh, you need to like, try and get rid of that. Before you go any further, take some photos. No. Give it a try. What the hell is it? Just a piece of metal? Oh, yeah, I've got it on the now. That looks a bit more promising. Yeah, let's see what I mean. After on. spiking your finger several times. That out to paddle because that'll dry. Um, I'll try it anyway with it in. I'll, I'll, t I'll I could take it out. Like, I'll see what's like. Do you want to head in? Oh, do you want to keep fishing or what? All right, I'll see what's like with paddling first, and then yeah, um, yeah well, that I might fish and catch more fishing. Like, are you sure? Wait, okay. just a paddle with board in there. <laughs> oh, it's a lot bigger board. See how it goes. See how it goes. How can you get the motor out? How can you get it out? <laughs> you can't, that's a thing. Because the propeller's pointing that way. I'm going to have the proper turn when I'm moving. Leave it up, leave it undone and see if you can pull it when I'm moving. Like, lift it out, see. Well, I'd rather that happen. Oh, crap, that's a little oh. third time I've just prepared that. Yeah, we've us. Eh? We've turned round. <laughs> oh, we're going the wrong way. Right, where was I? Where's my switch? The poor motor, pulling out this way. Oh, <laughs> 
struggling. Just struggling. All right. Just do, just go ahead. I'll cut off. Are you sure? Wait, I. Feeling confident? Yeah. I'm gonna ask you to do something. What's that? <laughs> Kneel on your kayak. Yeah. Put your hand under your kayak and straighten your prop. If there's two ears, I can keep a hold of your thingy. Rather than you rock and roll everywhere and then you can take your motor out. <laughs> Because it's your motor that's killing you when you're paddling. And then I'll be able to tow you in better. He tried your motor again. Yeah. I was thinking thermal cut off or something. I think you had one of them. Bob, I just need you to think of something. Hey? Bob, I just need to think of something. Thinking how I can reach right under there. I said, Neil, not stand. Neil, do. <laughs> you frightening. <laughs> oh, you put your leg through the loop. I know, I just felt it. Do you think you'll be able to reach under? You can virtually see it through the scupper hole. Would you believe? So I should not find a paddle anywhere. It it's further than you think. <laughs> I've done a bit. Oh, I'm MacGyver. I'm trying to think. Well, if we try and use the paddle at that angle. Try and pull the propeller in. Is your, is your paddle tethered? Yeah. yeah. Can you feel it? Oh. <laughs> Can you go the other way now and hold on to your kayak? I can push down, you see. You're sticking off a bit like. Oh, aye, I'll be for a few words yet, like. Aye. Right. Can you manage though? Oh, yeah, aye. Just take your time. Oh, good luck. <laughs> it's a pain in the fucking arse, like, but. Yeah, it's not the point, though. You're gonna get in, something's gonna go and click. Mm -hmm. That's what'll happen. All this fucking money for what you think's a decent body kayak. Fuck it. Maybe the fish move. I've got one anyway, one for the table that'll do me. Oh, it's not the flipping point. I know. Got should, have brought, should have brought the pedal drive with me as well. Just something else to carry. Yeah. But then, how do you get that out? 
Um, well, I don't know, I've left it in the car. Oh, we'll have them both out together, like. All oh, right. Yeah. So what are you going to do? Take that in, put the pedal drive in, come back out. The pedal drive's at home. Oh, shit. Aye, right, so I'm saying I should have kept it in the car. Aye. Could have put it in the car. Otherwise, I would have come back out. But, where's that flag on? <laughs> down there. A long way down. Aye. We are drifting quick now, aren't we? Oh, yeah, one. 1.3, one while right. really licking on, like. Aye, I'm, I'm I'll down. just go in now, mate. Put it this way, you'll be side on ish with the tide if you try and, like, use the tide. Aye. So, will you manage? Oh, yeah. I'll leave it to him. I know. Uh, see you next time. I will be, um, I will be sending it. Next week. Anywhere from Wednesday, I'm I'm Saturday to Tuesday. Yeah, see, I'm I'm back in Friday, so I'll have. I'll have Wednesday, Thursday. Hi. Anyway, trip cut short. Fault of the motor. Absolutely disappointed, really. Absolutely disappointed. Can't even get it out. So I have an easy paddle across the propeller. It's at 3 o'clock and 9 o'clock. So it does not fit through the hole. Another flaw in the design, as well as the, the live connection there which is already corroded. The connections inside the plug, as you've probably seen, melted. So, Galaxy, if you are watching, this needs to be sorted out. So I do understand there's a few people already bought these. Sam Davidson, check his uh, channel out, does really well, just trying to tour me in but because of the drag of the propeller, which I can't get up, obviously just to leave it there, uh, I'll hit any stain off for a little bit, so, good luck to him, I've got a fish, I've got one fish, I'm taking it home, so, it's not been a disappointing day apart from this uh, German motor. And down there, it's got to try and get all of this. The drift's quite quick. Yeah, just a bit. I'm, I'm actually quite disappointed. What's happened then? Um. Well, the connection to that seems to have melted onto the other side of it. See, because I've, 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 I've fitted it to here, you see? Yeah. As you can see, with that there, the salt water has already corroded that. It's fizzing. So to me, that is a bad design. God, well, I just put mine in a box like that. I didn't like putting holes in anything. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't because I, I thought you were returning this. I thought maybe it was always like a temporary thing. So I thought if I'm going to keep this in the long run, I may as well do it properly. Yeah. But you can see there's, there's water got on it and it's. it's, it's done it. And it's Bloody mad there. Underneath where the connection goes, the two prongs connect. It was literally melted together. Jesus. So you should be able to still pull the motor though if you needed to to get going anywhere because it doesn't have to be uh, straight at the front of it because uh, it will do its own thing, it will uh, straighten itself once you pull it up as it's curved. So what's your plan? Do you need a tow in? Oh no, I'm going to paddle. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to paddle. I when I pushed my pedal drive a while back. Yeah, you can see there's different colours on the prongs here like, but I've had a literally chip away some of the plastic that was on here. Jeez. 
Like, yeah, they're, they're, they're same decent, like. Yeah, but it's just a. Nice I was quite looking forward to going fishing, and it's just come to an abrupt end. Yeah, How'd you get on, be, by the way, anyway? Eh? How'd you get on? I've done all right. I've had a couple of rats, a little ling. I've had uh, a ling. Wow. Some, uh, some codling, neat pollock, still wet, but I think pollock is good. Well, the only one I've had pollock wise, it wasn't even worth taking home. I'm still waiting for that big one. Home. And then we're stuck. And I drifted. And I drifted. And I drifted. So the extent of drifting probably about plumbing or feels like two miles, but it's about three, four hundred yards after drifting. So I ain't stopping. I ain't stopping for nobody. No fish, no nothing. I'll fill this tomorrow. I'll fill this here tomorrow. So for the trouble for today, go home to McDonald's and drink lots of dirty beer. Um, as you know, I'm going in now. Um, so please, um, hope you like the video. There's been a few fish caught. I've missed a couple because of the battery going flat on the GoPro. Um, the battery on the motor, or the motor itself, is packed up as well. Hence, the paddle power. And it's killing my stomach. I'm starving. In a wee. So I'm going in. So. Thanks for watching. And if you haven't already done so, um, please subscribe to my channel. I would love it if you would. Like, um, comment below if you have to. If you want to, I should say. Comment below um, and I will. I do normally answer. Sometimes not straight away, but I do. So please feel free to leave your comments. If you like it, if you click on share because it will help. Build up my little uh, <laughs> my little channel. And like I said, it's free to subscribe. And I'd be very grateful if you could do so. So I will see you back in the show. But for now, screw in the canoe. A knackered screw in the canoe is out. See you on the next video. Anyway, caught the bloody ferry. I'm nearly back. It's been a killer, I'm gonna be honest with you. I've not enjoyed this last hour. In fact, I've not enjoyed the last couple of hours. Really mad. Nice this time. But, land ahoy. Thankfully. Right, finally got in. The GoPro battery died before I was entering. I'm um, just getting onto the beach. But I'm in, I have landed. Um, absolutely knackered. It took me um, an hour and a half, if not longer, to get back in against the tide, and it was absolutely hard graft. The hardest I've done for a long while. Um, yeah, it's, it, you know, take one, I should say. It's not massive, it's, uh, but it's for the table. Um, we set up as you can see 
would have been absolutely awesome against uh, the Beadnell fish, which Chris is still out there um, and he's doing really well apparently. Um, sadly, I've had to call it early because of the issue with the motor, which I am hoping Galaxy can help me out and fix it. Give me a new one. Oh. The issue with that, which is still a live terminal, I've had to disconnect the battery, it fizzes over and every time I try to take the tap off, I get the trick shock, which is not good. But, it's not all bad. Look at the place, it's absolutely gorgeous. And on that note, I'm done. I'm going to put this away. Um, get it loaded and I'm going to McDonald's get a coffee something to eat because I'm starving in a week so for now I'm out of here screw the canoe out <laughs>